Hello guys and uh, welcome to a new vlog. I'm on the roads again. I had a late morning at the hotel. I I editing the, my next video. But now I'm going to the Navajo National Monument. And I'm very excited what to see. Oh, sorry. It's very harsh sunlight today. And it's also very hot I think it's almost 20 degrees Celsius yeah I update you more later see ya Wrong turn. It's it's very very bumpy here. Yeah, it's very bumpy. Yeah, just look at the road. Guys, I just thought I could update you on the road conditions. Yeah, look here on the ground. It's so bumpy. Did you see it? Yeah, it's like ooh, all the time. Yeah, it's just 13 kilometers left. I don't know if we will turn around or if we will continue. I will ask the driver. Yeah. Talk to you later. turn around so we're going back now to a better road. See you then. National Monument. The detour delayed our travel schedule, so we're heading to the next destination instead. Yep, I think that will be good too. See you there. We are just going to end the Navajo National Monument. 
Look at the sign. Guys, just a short explanation. You didn't hear wrong before. Actually, after we had turned around from the wrong way, we had planned to go to the four corners. But along the way, we changed our mind again and decided to go to the Navajo National Monument. Back to the video. Dinosaur footprint. Footprints of small dinosaur that walked on his hind legs about 180 million years ago and then eventually turned to stone. Tracks of these three to Jurassic reptiles are very common here in the Navajo County. Forex Dick Hogan and Sweet House Exhibit. Oh! I guess it was here the Native Americans lived back in the time. And the sweat house, a miniature hogan used as a bath, actually more like a sauna. Wow, this is so so cool, yes look, the trail is well made and it's easy to walk here. I'm so excited what to see. Come on, let's keep on walking. Thank you. 
Hello guys, you just saw the Batata King uh, Old Town or something like that. Ancestral Pueblos lived here between 1250 to 1300. At the peak, about 100 persons lived here in 135 rooms all together used for storage, living and ceremonies. It's cool, it still remains, isn't it? have to hurry back before the visitor center close because the parking will close too. Yeah, see you. Did you like the old cliff dwelling? Pretty cool, huh? The visitor center is soon closing. So, see ya!
watching and for commenting, liking and subscribing. It means so much to me. Hope to see you next time.